Hey guys, welcome to today's video. So this morning I was in my workspace and I tried something new and it worked really well. So that's what I'm about to share with you guys. I can never get comfortable on these chairs. Um, so obviously this video is gonna be about my secret to discipline and this is something that I discovered very recently and by recently I mean like five hours ago. Um, I am one of the least not least, I'm disciplined in some things, but I find it really hard to stick to a schedule and I have to put in a lot of effort to make sure that I everything goes to plan. Like for me, it's a conscious effort. It's not just the type of person I am. I need to think really hard and try really hard to like stick to something and stick to a routine. So I've kind of nailed it in terms of morning routine now, nearly. I still find it hard to get out of bed, but I get out of bed and I go to the gym every morning at 6 30 and then i go to my workspace the sun's come out it might get really exposed um and then i come back home around lunchtime at like one o'clock have lunch and then i work again and do some learning and reading and stuff for the rest of the day but basically normally how i plan my day is i have everything written out so i have the different work blocks what i want to achieve in those work blocks so it'll be the task that i want to focus on for that 45 minutes and i have a break for 15 minutes where i usually read i like to read instead of going on my phone or sort of because it's on a kindle so i don't get any bad light from it or anything um and it keeps me off instagram and facebook and just social media so i normally do work work for 45 minutes then i read for 15 minutes and what happens in most days is that I'm not finished with the task, so I don't have any breaks and I just kind of half focused work the whole day and I've been sat in front of my laptop for like 12 hours. I'm, it's probably taken me 12 hours to do what I could have done in three hours if I just put my head down and focused. So that's like a typical day. That's, that's what will happen to me, which is what I've been trying to fix and which is what happened to me this morning, which I um, feel like it's going to work out. So. Anyway, let's get into what I actually did. So it's not that interesting. I don't know why I've done a big build up to it. But basically, how I have the times out normally, and normally I won't, like if I'm on something, I'm not finished it yet, I'll just kind of self-delegate in my head. I'll be like, oh, I'll just do it for another 30 minutes or I'll do it for another hour. And that's how it's a domino effect. As soon as I've said, been like a little bit lenient with one thing, the rest of the day just falls apart. Um, so this morning I had everything laid out and I was like, I looked at the amount of time I had for each thing and I said to myself, I actually don't need more time than what I've allocated to complete this. It's a task that I know is gonna take me under this amount of time and if I spend longer, it's because I've not done it focused. Like I've come, I've become distracted at some point. Um, so instead of letting myself sort of self-delegate more time and just run over and make up my own schedule and completely just d detract from what I'd laid out I made sure that no matter at whatever point I was at, as soon as that work block was up, I took a break. And as soon as it was over, I go back to work again on the next thing. And what happened? I just, I just felt so much better about myself. Like I felt like I'd achieved more and I felt like I had been more disciplined and sort of stuck to my schedule. Like I moved through everything so quickly and I was like, hmm, this actually isn't that hard. Like I only, I spent the amount of time I said I would. I. God, I actually didn't really like leave anything half finished. There was some stuff that I could have spent longer and if I hadn't have had that structure in place where I said I was going to go through it, I would have stayed doing it and that one task would have just taken up the rest of the work blocks and the rest of my list would have basically been void. So it worked really well. Um, so every time I got to the work block, start and I did exactly what I had written down and I just moved through everything and it went so fast. The time went so fast I felt so much more focused and just happier um and i think like i was thinking about why why i actually felt that way and why it was helping so much and i think it's just because when you sort of celebrate the little wins like you, the little successes that you have it has a bigger effect on your mental state and how you really feel so even though that was such a small thing like sticking to a work block it was me sticking to a schedule and sort of following through with something that i said i was gonna do and it's the same principle that you could take to maybe a project or a goal you have for yourself. You say, I'm going to complete this within X amount of time. And that could be making 100k a year or it could be to finish a book in a week. And for me today, it was to stick to those times and those work blocks and I did it. So 
that little concept kind of positively reinforced my brain to be like, huh, like I, st I stuck to something and like the day went well and I feel good. So now it's, I don't know if that, if that has, if I've explained it properly, um, but I feel like it's been a really sort of positive, it's had a positive mental effect on me today. Just sticking to my schedule, I've just felt way more in control of my own mind. And I guess that sort of lined up with being in control of of my time and my schedule has just made me feel way more free. So yeah, that was today's video. Um, I hope you guys found it interesting. Um, I don't know if that's what you guys do, like if you stick to it, maybe I've just like come across this and this is like what everybody else does anyway. Um, but let me know what you do below. If you ever sort of run out of time doing a task and you have something else planned, do you stay doing that same task or do you move on and keep the discipline and the structure and then just put the little bits that you didn't finish to the end of the day or to the next day and just keep yourself moving forwards again like on a path that doesn't have much friction um but yeah let me know in the comments below i hope you enjoyed this video and i'll see you in tomorrow's one